First of all, Olivia, you look so dang cute. That's her old birthday shirt. Well, I'm wearing I'm wearing this because it's kind of like one like this. And we have when we have our dance teacher, and she loves to go like this for in the morning. She's uh -huh. well, like, I can't do it. It's so yeah. Funny. But like, we'll try and stay like this, and we do like a lot of yoga in it. And um, so I wrote her a card, and we saw her last night at the game. Because she, she taught the Logan cheerleaders. Olivia, you are always So very I wrote a thoughtful. note for her. Okay. And I put, Dear Self, today you will truly shine. <laughs> wow. And then this little contraption that you've got going on uh, right there. Don't, don't mind that. It, they keep um, falling. You, what are you taking all of those books for? Well, today we have a, a read a thon. It's like, well, like, oh. you can just read a whole bunch of books for like an hour. I love read a thons. Promise you won't lose any and bring them all home. Okay, Cody, it's pushing time for him. He does not want to be like, okay, Boston, put that away. We are not doing airplanes right now. Put it all the way away. <gasps> Coming. I wanted to pour my pajamas, my pink pajamas. <laughs> Believe like... me, we have enough time. Boston, get your shoes on. Wait, Standing guys, here trying to get ready because I have to be somewhere. You have, no, snow boots, snow boots. You guys, my kids fight me That's the every point. morning about wearing their snow boots. They want to wear their tennis shoes. We just got five inches of snow on the ground. Yes, you guys, put your snow boots on. Put your tennis shoes in your backpack. Are they in your backpack? Okay, you're gonna make yourself late. I was gonna say, Cody's been really worried about being late. You're gonna make yourself late if you don't hurry and get your shoes put on. Um, and seeing Lady walk around makes me super happy, but what it makes me think of is all the mean comments that were like, you're never letting your dog out. She's never gonna learn. And I just had to bite my tongue because she was a six month old puppy. Of course, I wasn't gonna let her wander around my house. Anyway, she's super well behaved and she has been not having um, very many accidents. Tell what Says who? Daddy. Tell, tell me what happened last night with Lady on the bed. I saw the lady with the square bed and she stayed. Like literally. You kept her in the little thing like and we I talked had about? Had one open and she just literally, all she did was she just laid in the back and she'd chew on her toy. So she stayed she there. So she literally, that's all. See, I knew she would do that because like whenever she's in a crate, she doesn't like to eat her bones outside <gasps> on my bed. Lady, I'm proud of you. Olivia, that's really amazing. So Good job I, doing that. So Look, tonight, she won't go in my room. So tonight, I mean, see, she off. knows not to go in my room. Mom, so look, oh girl. So tonight, I'm gonna take off two pillows. Okay, you have to let us know how it goes. Good morning. Usually, Lincoln's the first one to wake up, but he was the last. The kids are all at school, and you woke up after you slept in all morning. We don't get to check a little thing off of our chart, but we'll try again for tomorrow, okay? Okay. How come you're so tired? Should we tell him what you did last night? What did you do last night? You don't remember? Can you think and tell me? Do you want me to tell him? Bree took all the kids last night to, where was it? Oh, still not quite awake. Tay's, Bree's sister's, Basketball, basketball game. game. Bree has taken the kids to all of Tay's like sporting homes. events, and my kids run around like wild, buy all the things from the food stands, and just live their best lives. They love Tay. They love Tay and Bree and Bree's family. Bree's family is so ridiculously good to my kids. I just couldn't be more grateful. I think the reason that he didn't pass off a check mark on his potty training mm -hmm. or his nighttime training is because they found a drinking fountain last night and played in it forever. And even little Boston wouldn't be checking it. Yeah, <laughs> Boston box can't off check off his thing either. <laughs> what <laughs> fountain? What was it serving? Fruit punch? Okay, well, I'm walking out the door. Thank you, Joel, for putting all of our Bali brand samples in the Suburban for me. We are going to meet at the modeling agency that we use. We have two models that we're using from them. We're gonna go try their clothes on them. So, let's hope they fit. <laughs> Goodbye, Linky, I love you. You have a really good day with Daddy. What did you want for breakfast? Some scrambled eggs? I just killed it. Huh. 
You want scrambled eggs? Okay. <laughs> what? Huh? You're not, no, Joel. Joel, we are not going to breakfast. It's Friday. Uh, it's Friday and I am not. <laughs> if me and you are going to go get something yummy for dinner, you can't have something yummy for breakfast and lunch. I'm not gonna have, what if I don't have anything for lunch? No, oh. no, mm. no. Okay. If I'm going to eat really clean, you're going to eat really clean, and we have to, and it's Friday night, so we have to save our meals today. You can have celery for breakfast. Just kidding. Budgeting calories sucks. I'm just kidding. Yes, that's exactly what we're doing. We're budgeting our calories for date night. If I come home to like fast food things from him, I'm going to kill him. Illy and I have to drive about an hour and a half to get to where we're going, and so I'm just really hoping that the canyon isn't worse than here. Full stop. Can't believe I live in your thoughts. I think about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful delight. Oh, I need to be recording this. Okay, the whole time I'm like, when we do our photo shoot, we'll have the models to say what she's saying, but I'm missing all of this. This is the, what's your position? A booking agent at Naya. Yep, so she's the booking agent um, at Naya Models, which is where we've been finding our models, and she just felt our lounge dress, and what did you say? I would not take that off, yeah, ever. She, but it was like, <laughs> with like a happy squeal, she was like, oh my gosh, I would never take that off, and I'm like, those are the things people need to hear, so I'm gonna start recording these. describe that to people like how do you describe how good that feels you know what I mean it's almost impossible like a cloud I mean it's uh -huh. like it's uh -huh. I'm taking the whole thing out because it's just like <laughs> oh, oh this one's the shirt this one's oh, not the dress but yeah, they're the same material I love that isn't the color perfect what is this okay. yeah um do you want to know it's really interesting so she wants to know what it's made out of and it is made out of it's 93% polyester. Really? Yes, and we get a lot, We in the past we've gotten a little bit of flack for, oh, you guys use polyester, but polyester is, you there's can- There's such a range. There's, it's, everything yeah. is made out of polyester. Yeah. This also has spandex in it, but. Which is even. Yeah, it's, though. Like, everybody, not you, but everybody's all <laughs> <laughs> spandex. Yeah. Like, I don't know what it is, but everything, like, you guys use is just really comfortable. <laughs> Girl, yes! <laughs> she tried on our jumpsuit and she said, I could go for a run in this. I did say that. <laughs> you are amazing. That's, that looks so nice on you. Yeah. It's yeah. so pretty. It's like the perfect length too. Like a lot of dresses, especially like mini dresses, will end up being like mini dresses. And yeah. So like, I don't know. What How think. tall are you? I'm like 5'11 and a half. 5'11 yeah. and a half, and it looks perfect on you. Yeah. So far, the biggest thing that everyone is mentioning is the feel of the material, which brings our hearts so much joy because that was like, that's our main focus. How is it one day we feel so like, oh, and then one day we're like, this is good. <laughs> well, when all the models and everyone has touched everything, they're, they're blown away by the feel of it, and that was the goal. Even when we would sit down in the designer's office, they'd be like, this is good, this is good. We're like, no, it's not. Yeah. And we really fought for the materials that we wanted and they're like, oh, it's too expensive to do those materials And we were like, okay, well, then we have to do them anyway oh. That's really cute. They fit Look cute you. on your ankle <laughs> Yeah, they fit good on your ankle. Did you notice that these are like the, the Coordinating. Yeah, yes. that's cute. I, like, did notice that. Oh my gosh. It's perfect. This oh my god This one's like, I don't even know. It's just, it has pockets. That's yes <laughs> Everything I put on so far. Good. Like, sometimes shorts and pants, especially, will have like that weird gap like on your uh -huh. back. And like then you like pull it tight with these, but like with the scrunch, I feel like it's nice because it already like fits against your legs. Oh, you good. Look so beautiful. Good. That is such a pretty top. I like that. They're wrinkly. We haven't like they're like fresh from the box. <gasps> okay, I was worried that the bottom was going to be really wide, but it isn't. Yeah. No, I actually this is like the perfect because it's not like too. 
I don't know, like it doesn't box out. You're like, okay, but what I liked about the bodysuit was yeah. like the double like class, like you could yes. choose which size because too many bodysuits like give you a wedgie or make you feel like you're gonna wear a diaper yeah. or like yep. stuff like that. Exactly. And this fits like well. Good. Turn around, let's see the back. And we'll probably pair this bodysuit with the black pants and not these yellow ones, but either works. <gasps> oh my gosh, I am so incredibly happy. <laughs> she said we should have kept this one for last because she doesn't ever want to take it off. <laughs> well, I want to show it on you because I showed it in our other model. That's dang cute on you. It's dang cute. So soft. Oh, the color. It looks so beautiful on your with your hair. Um, I want you to say what you said again about the color. Oh, about how the color looks good on everyone. Mm -hmm. It doesn't wash anybody out. It looked really good on Alicia's skin, and it looked really good on um, our super pale model as well. Mm -hmm. And we're pale. <laughs> so it looks good. On, I, I love it on us. I love it. So much all of the waistbands that we would buy hit so much lower and we just felt like the natural waistline is a little higher and if you're wanting to i don't know it just flatters i like so that too better. i'm glad you like that about it <laughs> That's so I'm cute. they fit really really well yes what's nice is you don't have the extra material right here uh-huh so it keeps it smooth but there is room for like the days where maybe I had a pizza the night before. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. That's really cute. Like and I like that. So do I. I like that you didn't tuck the back in. Yes. That's really cute. Untucked in the oh. back. Split is really nice because you can tuck it in or it fits over the hips. Yep. Over the booty. When we were trying that shirt on, I, we just did not want it tight around our waists, like around our tummies, because that's just not comfortable and it doesn't. Like it's just not comfortable. And that was our goal in all of these pieces was that we um, were comfortable in every single piece but that they didn't look sloppy. And that is the number one comment that all Everyone of our models said. said. Mm -hmm. It's comfortable. And that slit on the hip is what we added and I kept saying bring this slit a little higher, bring this slit a little higher because they just had this like itty bitty little slit and we made them put in a big slit on the side so that if you do have big hips, um, we'll it over. would fit over it nicely. Yeah, so we're pretty happy about that. <laughs> she said she liked it too. This is Ellie and I have been stressing, okay? <laughs> and the fact that the models and the agent, the modeling agency, really, really likes the clothes. Like I wasn't even gonna film this. I wasn't planning on filming, but then all their reactions, I was like, I've got to get this get the out. out. <laughs> I'm like taking pictures. <laughs> Okay, after the try-on with all the models, Ellie and I were in the car and we were talking about our model, Alicia. She's typically a 2XL, and in our last photo shoot, in our last line, she wore all of our 3X sizes. And she gave us the critique that the 2X was too tight, but that she really liked the fit overall. It was just the sizing was a little off. We also, at the traffic circle, sorry. Sorry, I didn't listen to you. It's okay. There you go. We also got that um, same feedback on, um, like, in reviews on our clothes, which I don't think, I don't take that as negative. I just think, okay, let's revamp our sizing. So last time we were in New York, we, we hired someone to go over all of our sizing and to change up the sizing. And she did say, she was like, your sizing is a little off, especially on the, t on the larger sizes. And that is why so many people don't do plus size clothing is because it is very expensive to get the grading down. You don't just take your medium, because what you do you on sizing is you take a size and you scale down. Like you take the size medium, you scale down. You take the size medium, you size up. But once you get to extra large, it changes. You can't just scale all the way up to a 3X. So we actually have all new, um, what's the word? Patterns from extra large up to a 3X. And so it actually will fit so much better. And praise be, <laughs> the model that um, Alicia, she was wearing all 2X sizes today in our new line and they fit her so well. She was so complimentary and so happy with the way they fit and our 3X, we had a 3X model, I don't know if we filmed her very much, but 
she was very pleased with the way it fit her as well. So Ellie and I are just so proud that our sizing, like we improved something. And each time Ellie, each time we, ah! each time we um, do something, or each line that we put out, we are improving. And that's all we can ask for. We know that we're not perfect. We know that we're new at this. And there are so many bumps along the way. But each line we've improved, and I feel so grateful that we can make those changes. So thank you, oh, okay. Thank you guys for giving us your feedback. We really appreciate it. We're listening and we're making those changes. All right, we are going to hop out of the car and go get some lunch. I think we're gonna close the vlog here because that was just a really great part of my day. That I mean, that was it. That was the day. We're gonna eat and we're gonna go home and crash. <laughs> It feels like it's been a long road getting here um, to the point of having our models try it on. We were stressing. Oh, last night we both went to bed like, ugh. But well, then we are happy now. <laughs> well, seeing our clothes on models, real bodies, and there is no such thing as a real body, we just, if I'm being honest, it's really hard for me because my body, it doesn't fit into a small and it doesn't fit into a medium. There isn't one pair of pants that I own in my closet that I don't have to alter the waist on. And so when I was trying on my clothes, it's like, oh, all of a sudden I forgot that. And I'm like, our pants don't fit. They're not gonna fit anyone. No, Bonnie, they just don't fit you. <laughs> Unlike, same with all the other clothes in my pocket. Oh, I thought he was saying hi to me. I was like, hey. <laughs> I think he wants to go to Petco. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. So that's why I was feeling a bit discouraged, but trying on with the models today really revamped my um, confidence oh. in the line. It really did. So there was all positive things to say, and we didn't even meet, know two of them. Yeah. So it's not like they were trying to butter us up. No. It was amazing. Yeah, and it, it was very unbiased opinions, which made me feel really good so I hope this wasn't too long-winded for you guys um, the line will be launching at the very end of February like 28th ish so keep an eye on our Instagram that's where we update all of those things I'll put a link for our website for Bali brand in the description and then also for Bali brands Instagram thank you guys so much for watching and doing this whole journey with us and we'll see you guys in the next video bye guys oh, stop. Believe I live in your thoughts. I think about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful day.